Let's start with what obesity isn't. It isn't a your fault problem or a simple issue with a lack of willpower. Obesity is a chronic progressive medical condition and it's recognized as such by the Canadian Medical Association. And this disease uh, presents itself with a deposition of excess fat in the body that results in a deterioration of a patient's health. Obesity also causes a whole host of other diseases including high blood pressure, high cholesterol, diabetes, heart disease, strokes, and cancer, as well as a uh, tendency for early death. While we don't completely understand this very complicated disease, we know there's a whole host of genetic and environmental factors that cause it. And there's a very complex interplay between uh, our gut hormones and the centers in our brain that signify reward and hunger. Uh, and the way that these centers interact with our gut hormones impacts how we tend to put on our weight and uh, how we keep the excess fat on our bodies, causing a deterioration of our health. Bariatric surgery is the most powerful therapeutic option for the treatment of obesity. It's not for everyone and it certainly uh, requires a motivated patient and a whole multidisciplinary team to support that patient before surgery and going forward after surgery. At the Richmond Hospital, we offer three types of bariatric surgery, the sleeve gastrectomy, the gastric bypass, and the duodenal switch. All three are covered by MSP and all three are done laparoscopically or by minimally invasive techniques. The sleeve gastrectomy is a resective surgery. We remove about 80% of the patient's stomach and that tends to decrease uh, both hunger uh, and increase your feeling of satiety or fullness early uh, after a meal. The sleeve gastrectomy is uh, a really good surgery for patients whose body mass index is between 35 and 45 with uh, some comorbidities such as diabetes but uh, where the comorbidities aren't overly severe. The gastric bypass is considered the international gold standard for bariatric surgery. It's been around the longest and it has a very good track record for durable weight loss and comorbidity reduction. It's excellent at reducing things uh, like diabetes or high blood pressure and in fact can often result in a remission of these diseases. The gastric bypass is considered a malabsorptive procedure because we reroute the intestinal tract and again this is done laparoscopically. The duodenal switch, or its whole name is the biliopancreatic diversion with duodenal switch, is what I call the nuclear option for the treatment of obesity. It is a combination of both the sleeve gastrectomy and a longer intestinal bypass, again done laparoscopically. This should be reserved for patients who have a very high body mass index or who have very severe comorbid diseases such as insulin-dependent diabetes. In the right patient, bariatric surgery can result in an 50 to 80 percent decrease in excess body weight. It can also eliminate multiple diseases such as diabetes, high blood pressure, high cholesterol, and joint pain. Studies have shown that there's a significantly decreased risk of heart attack and stroke following bariatric surgery and possibly even cancer rates. People tend to live longer after bariatric surgery. However, up to 30 percent of our patients can have weight regain in the years following bariatric surgery. This is why it's so important to incorporate uh, a food and exercise journal as a lifelong habit and incorporate 30 to 45 minutes of exercise daily. Our multidisciplinary team will work with you to make sure bariatric surgery is the right option for you and is a safe option for you. Bariatric surgery is a very complicated topic and we provided some information on our website that we hope you will find helpful. We very much look forward to being involved in your care.